Hi there guys, welcome to this video, this is a Quantum Gaming Uploads What I'll be showing in this video is a Sedona DLC that we got on this week, uh, marketplace, up marketplace update, yep So we're gonna see how everything is from what I've seen and from what I heard This uh, place is like fantastic, they've done an incredible job So let's go guys Let's check them out So this is on Series X so let's go and I chose this uh, beautiful little plane to take us around I mean this plane can go anywhere man it's tiny but uh, very good look at all those rocks look at those beautiful rocks so I'm gonna check them all out and hope everybody's uh, having a great uh, weekend. We cannot wait for the weekend. Let's check this one first. Then we can come back to that one. Let's check these because it's got the markings. See how beautiful they look. What job they've done. Oh yes, yeah, very nice. You can tell they've been polished up and looks like great. I like it when they do things like this. And it's a beautiful place just to fly around. Just to look at the scenery, which is amazing. Probably millions of years ago, this used to be all underwater. Probably that's why it looked like this. And you can tell by the shapes and everything. Definitely this must have been all water up here. Yep. Stunning. Absolutely gorgeous. Man. Look at this thing. These guys are so lucky to live there, man. Let's look at all these places. They're so lucky, you know. Just to live next to this stuff. I mean, you can go everywhere there. You can go everywhere, every day. Every day is never a boring day, you know. Every day would be like a fantastic day to just go around. That's stunning, man. And you can see the sea levels here, guys. Where the right where that uh, orange stuff ends. And you can tell where the sea was. Very cool, very cool. What a stunning place, man. And it looks fantastic on the Series X. Maybe I'm gonna try a Series S as well, but definitely looks fantastic. So they polished all this up, they worked on them. It makes it look even more like a real life. All cleaned up, very nice. Beautiful. Let's check this other rock in here. All these people that live here, yeah. Fantastic. Imagine living next to those rocks there. Just, uh, nature is beautiful.
Absolutely stunning, guys. Just lovely here. And I'm gonna go back, I'm gonna go around, and I'm gonna use uh, the cockpit camera. Just see how it looks from the cockpit instead. Even these small rocks here, they've done them. Amazing. Look at this beautiful thing, man. Wow. Let's check this other rock out. Chimney rock. Beautiful. Okay, cockpit time. I put the airport just in the perfect place on top of that uh, small hill there. Great, great job. This area is absolutely fantastic guys, just look behind there as well, just look at this thing man, apart from these rocks, just look on the right there, everything is just so fantastic, you know, amazing, what a lovely place to be man, just to live here, it could be like, it will uh, extend your life for sure, you can live longer by just living in this place, just the uh, nature and everything is like, I would go, if I lived in here, I would go here every day. Every day I would go different places. Every day just go out. Forget about the uh, TV and all that, we don't need that stuff. Not when you're here, you can go just anywhere. Let's take a bike or something, or... It'd be great. I mean, people just to dream about this stuff. They'll never have the chance. To be in a place like this, let alone live here. Wow, I would love, I would love it just to be here. Just once at least, just to have a look around. Just go and take a backpack and water and stuff and just go all the way around it. I mean, it's massive. You won't do that in a day, but... It will take you weeks just to go around this thing, but every day do one bit at a time. Absolutely gorgeous. But it's funny with life, guys. Uh, you don't appreciate something when you have it until it's gone. Because you think it's always going to be there. And uh, 
when it's gone, it's gone, and you regret it after. Same, I'm guessing, for the people that live around this area. They probably forgot that they live there, and how great it is. Just uh, it becomes like normal, you know what I mean? It becomes just a house, just a place. It doesn't. They don't think of it as a special thing. Only people from outside can say, "Oh, look at that stunning area there." Well, I'm guessing oh, how many tourists would come in here every year. Loads, probably. Maybe those places are maybe just for tourists, I don't know, but they look like houses, proper houses. I'm sure people live in here, from the US, of course. And I don't know how much the cost of living would be in this area, something like this. Is it going to be expensive? Is it like a, when it comes to housing and all that? Not sure how expensive it would be compared to other cities. But any price it can be, it's not going to be worse than uh, London. London is the worst when it comes to pricing. Who prices in uh, in London are like crazy, guys. You don't want even. Who you can get like a two bedroom. Like 1600 pounds. That's like uh, 18, 1900 dollars. Yeah, every month. Forget about the rest, the uh, console tax and internet and all that. It comes like it goes to two grand every month. So it's not cheap at all, man. Not when you get paid uh, 1200 a month and 1300 a month. You cannot do it on your own. You have to be like either with a partner or have somebody else living with you. But you cannot achieve it. Never. Cost of living in London. Ne you can never survive it on your own. That's for sure. Those days are gone. Long gone. And it's getting harder and harder. Find the right place or to even find a place. If you lose your place, you're gonna struggle finding a, a good one or a, even a decent one in London. Stop, man. Stop, guys. But in place like this, so many, so much space around, probably would be like uh, much cheaper to live here. But let me know, guys, if you know. If somebody lives in here, let me know what, what the prices are or. What's the cost of living in this area? Is it a... Uh, I'm guessing all these, these are houses, all this stuff here. There must be houses, all these. All these things here. They look like, definitely look like houses. All this stuff here. Looks like a busy city. But uh, not all buildings, only small allowed probably. I'm guessing regulations, probably only three stories max, I would say, in this area. Not all buildings because of the mountains. But yeah, lots of houses in here. Let's look at this. Beautiful. Trying to place the land. What's that, guys? What's that? What's that thing there? I don't have any birds in this area, so I don't, what does it? What's that? What's that? Let me stop it for a second. What the? What the flip is that? Oh man, that's a house. Is it a floating house? Is that a house, honestly? Is it? It is, yeah. <laughs> 
what's that, what, what, what's that in the sky? I haven't got any birds in this area. Oh man, that made me laugh. Is it gone? No, it's there, it's still there. Oh man, I think I'm gonna add this video here, guys. I think I'm gonna keep it here. But I'm gonna post just a clip of this. Oh, we got a floating house right over Sedona. Hey. Well, that's funny, man. Yeah guys, hopefully you enjoyed this video. You're one and only Quantum Gaming uploads. Take care guys. All the best. Have a nice weekend. Thank you. Thanks for watching. Bye bye.